Hey everyone. Yes, this is another video of me talking. Um, well, I think people are still asking if I'm going to be buying stuff from Spirit Halloween. And like I said, I'm going to try to. Okay, big props or animatronics, whatever you want to call them. I want to try and limit myself to 10 props. I know already that 10 is a lot, but you know me, I usually go overboard even on that. So I'm going to try to only get 10 big ones. That doesn't include tabletops, and that doesn't include other stores. So that's just Spirit, the big animatronics, the pricey ones. Because my parents don't want me buying any more stuff at all. And I'm probably going to have to buy that stuff when I'm when they're not home, but they're still going to find it anyway. And I'm probably going to get yelled at because, you know, everything's in a storage unit right now where the house is still full. But... Yeah, whatever, that's... <laughs> I don't care. I, But the, if you're probably wondering which props I want to buy, well, for now, I don't exactly have ten picked out. I have five picked out for sure, I believe. Morning Gory, Pudding, Ghost Girl, um, The Rising Reaper, The Rising from the Grave Ghoul. Mm. There was one more I had. Uh, I go blank spaced on camera. Oh yeah, and the lunging girl. But other than that, I don't know what others I'm going to be getting. I just have to see them first. I might get Sitting Scarecrow. I don't know. It, like I said, I'm trying to limit myself to 10, but... Yeah. But anyways, and I'm... I'm all, I'm really looking forward to going to Menards very soon here. They'll they'll have their Halloween stuff up, and I'm excited to make videos. And I'll probably see something I like there, and I'll probably end up buying it because Menards usually always has something cool. Uh, I've always seen something I liked at Menards, but yeah, we'll we'll have to see with that. And Target, I looked on their website, and I plan on buying the three new chattering heads, and I think a couple other things, but. Not as much as last year. I bought. I literally bought almost everything from Target last year. I got the Haunted Hedge, Rising from the Grave. So basically, the only things I didn't get was the zo the seeding zombie fish or whatever the he heck it is. <laughs> um, the that hand, that tapping hand or whatever, and uh, the radio. I, those are and the candy bowl, but they never had the candy bowl. I never saw. I got that little Haney Ghost, the little, that Reaper that broke the first time I got it. I got that. Um, the to Tombstone, the Talking Tombstone, three Chattering Heads, just everything last year. I got it. Same thing with Nars. I got almost everything from Nars last year, too, just not the Lunging Reaper, which I kind of hope he is back, but I don't know. Probably. Anyways. Yeah, I don't know the rest of the list of what I plan on buying. It's been the new teddy bear prop I might buy. I'll have to see if I like it. But I might I might buy it even if I don't like it just to go with the other two. Because that seems to be what I do. Because this is something I've never really mentioned before. But half the stuff that I bought was stuff I never had on my list or planned on buying. I'll give you examples. Silent and Deadly Clown. Never planned on dying him. I didn't really like him at first. I don't know even why. I think it's just... I bought the sword display, but it, it, it functioned different than the other ones. It's not that the soundtrack is higher. It was the same as all of them, but... I noticed that, like, you're supposed to turn to the side and then stop. And then turn to the other side and then stop. But he doesn't do that. His relay switch is always been broken he he goes to the side and then to the other side and stops so it's kind of i don't know i for some reason i guess i just liked that <laughs> um but i ended up getting him the clown mirror i didn't even like that at all either i ended up getting that for no reason skeeves the butler he was never on my list. i got him the chirps he they were never on my list i got the store display of that pretty much i got the store displays of all this because Brown mirror was the store display. The chirps was the store display. That's why it has the rip in the mouth. The Steve's was the store display. So, I bought a lot of store displays. Um, 
Yeah, and uh, there's many others. Uh, let me think here for a second, see what other ones I got that I never planned on getting. I I think I didn't want to get Wolf Spirit at first, but I did after a while. Oh yeah, the flame, the flaming Black Widow Witch. I didn't want her at first, but the reason I liked her is just her sayings. I I like her sayings. She I, she's pretty unique. Um, untimely death. I never planned on getting her at first. I I ended up getting her. Um, the evil scientist got him. I never he was never on my list before. Um. The Electrocuted Maniac, he was never on my list. Um, Mossy Nurse was on and off my list throughout that season. I don't know, but I ended up getting her. I don't know if Wheelchair Psycho was always on my list. He wasn't moving as fast in the Spirit demo video, so I think that's what made me not want him at first. But when I set him up in person, I saw how fast he actually moved, so I liked him a lot more. Um... Let's see, who else? I mean, there's a lot of them. Zombie Barrel and Bone Collector, I think they were always on my list, but I didn't really think I was going to be able to get them. But I, I don't know really about those two. Um, there's just so many <laughs> that were not on my list that I ended up getting. Oh, yeah, the Limb Ripper Werewolf. I didn't want him at first either, really. I ended up getting him, though. Um, just... Yeah, I think you're getting the idea now, but... Yeah. Oh, yeah, the, the Limb Eating Zombie and Twilight Twitcher. I didn't want them at first, but I ended up getting them. I ended up getting two of them, actually, but I don't have two of them anymore. I just have one set, but still. <laughs> yeah, there, like I said, there was a lot of them that I never planned on buying. But, I don't know, I, I, I work with these things, and I hear them all day long. And for some people, that would drive them nuts and make people not want them but for some reason it gets stuck in my head and it makes me want them more now props that i did end up wanting that i wasn't able to get which of course you know me i want everything witch of stolen souls moonshine zombie barrel um i would have gotten witch of stolen souls last season but the uh store owner took it took them we had three left he took them to a different store i wish i could, i mean i don't know because he my, like i said the store owner for our spirit owns five stores here bismarck fargo rapid city that's south dakota suit falls and other and one other location yeah and he lives in colorado but he comes down here to do the halloween stores um but yeah and let's let me see oh yeah the Incinerator is another one that I didn't really want at first. He just wasn't my type, but the only reason I bought it is because the store display. I, I didn't want to buy one disassembled. I wanted to buy a completely disassemb uh, completely assembled because I didn't want to put that together. I didn't like the setup to that thing. Of course, I'll be setting up it again at Spirit this year because it's coming back to stores. But... My, I, I'm pretty sure that mine is breaking, though. You saw that it, it was popping up twice. Like, after it goes back down, as soon as the lights shut off, it pops back up again and goes back down. But sometimes it doesn't go down, so I don't know what's going on with that thing. I, I don't know. But it's kind of cool that it pops up twice, honestly. But I'm just worried that it's going to stop moving or something, you know? <laughs> but, I don't know. Let me think of... Let me see. Okay, I wanted the toilet zombie, the pop-up grave zombie. A lot of people didn't like it just because the uh, audio was bad, but I, I still liked it. Even even though you can't understand what it's saying, I still like the audio anyways. Um, who else? Of course, Splitting Tombstone Bride. That was one I never got that I really wanted. I kind of wanted the Harbinger of Hell, but he was just a lot. I don't know. I do like the Harbinger of Hell, though. People always wondered why I never got the Sweeney props. It's because I have nowhere to hang them. My ceilings are not made for those type of things. I mean, I would like to get... I would like to get Pumpkin Nester, honestly. I planned on getting him that first year, but I was never able to because he sold out. In the second year, I didn't really want him as much anymore, but I still remembered that I had nowhere to hang it, so it, there was no point for me buying him. I would like to find another dead humor thrashing queen. I just kind of <laughs> like those two. My dead humor doesn't work with battery.